اوزبلیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ربش رخلی صدری و یسر علی عمری واہل الدمسان یف قولی اللہ مفتہ خلین حکمت گا ونش و علین رحمت گا یا ضل جلال و الکرام السلام علیکم ایوری ون اوکے ٹو ڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو لرن اباؤٹ اور ٹو کریٹ دس اینیمیشن دیٹ یو کین سی اوور ہیئر یوزنگ اسکریچ ون پوائنٹ فور سافٹ ویئر اینڈ ہاؤ ٹو یوز کسٹیوم افیکٹیولی ان اسکریچ ون پوائنٹ فور Okay, uh, this is one way of programming your sprites learning basics, uh, basic programming skill with the help of Scratch 1.4. So uh, let's take a start. Now I am going to use uh, to do something else. I am going to remove this all script and I want to do something else. so i'm going to uh, first of all let me save this file click on file save as let's write description over here underwater move your divers using script programming statements let me write here project 1 and just click on ok this project is here successfully now I want to do what uh, I need to create another project click on file new ok now I want to do what uh, clear the stage Okay, now uh, first I need to put some background over here, click on stage, go to the background, now click on import and now I want to select uh, a suitable background, outdoors, 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 okay, outdoors. Uh, which one nature indoor indoor okay this one school one got it okay uh, now what I want I want put sprites over here so that they will start moving over here so for that I need to choose a sprite Now in people I want to pick this one. Okay. Now click on OK. okay. okay now, now click on costume. Import. Not this one, this one. I want this one. walking uh, walking boy this one so I need pick this delete this one okay import second one import again I'm adding different costumes over here so that we can switch between different costume to create a living of that this sprite is walking on this stage Board. this one okay one more sprite this one okay done this thing okay costumes done in behind the sprite when you click sprite then you need to click on costume and then add import different uh, sprites Okay, now click on script. Now I'm going to use forever blocks. Let me shrink this. Yeah, let me place it over here. Okay, uh, even smaller. Yeah, adjust it now. Now what I need to do, uh, I need to write a script using a for loop. Click on control. Okay, whenever you press, for example, um, let's say, okay, uh, when green flag clicked, or when sprite one clicked. 
let's say let's try this when sprite one click to what forever go to forever block so that it can repeat this instruction whatever i'm going to insert or put inside this forever block it will repeat it again and again so forever move 10 steps let's try this okay sorry when you click on this sprite because written here when sprite one click so click here oh that's too much it's too faster okay now what uh, what i need to do i need to try, uh, control its movement using our control block done and just set this to zero point let's say zero point five place it back over here okay uh, okay fine but what I want it will not cross this edge so I need to put what in motion block I'm going to select if on edge bounce back this one over here so let's see it cross this boundary or not oh it bounces back inverted now let me uh, turn this face only face left right click here this option done okay but it's not working okay uh, I what I want yeah, I need to put word costume as well so um, mm -hmm. let me add one when uh, when sprite one clicked this condition okay <clears throat> it looks forever <clears throat> add the next costume you can see even from here whenever I click here look there it's switching between very quickly between different sprites I want to control its movement so what I need to do I just put a weight block over here as well now it's too slow double click here just write 0 0.25 interesting let me change this as well 0 0.25 Good now. Okay. Uh, now I want to create its multiple copies. So click on duplicate and just click here. One more sprite created. So just place it over here and now click on. Click on it. Just click on it. Come on, move. Now I want to add <coughs> another uh, sprites or here uh, so that they can do what a dancing sprite over here. So I'm going to click on a new folder, a uh, new sprite, and I want what this one break dance. Okay, just click on it. It's like this one. Now just click here, sprite 1, go to the costume, again import the sprite, go back, repeat the same procedure, break dancer, this one, and this one, done, okay, let me Showing this okay. the middle over here so uh, now let's start now click on script same script I'm going to apply over here uh, where is that script uh, reuse that script this one when sprite one click okay this is not sprite one so I need only this costume this one this code let me place this 
behind this code added now it will appear automatically because it's a sprite 3 and it will appear over here sprite 3 forever next costume so click on costume and you can see that when i click on uh, this sprite as well it will start dancing with them that's how you can use a uh, forever loop weight block effectively and you can even use costume as well look here just switching between different sprites you can create the illusion of dancing this sprite sprite is what's a character it's an object but you can see on that this stage okay thank you very much if you like uh, my video please uh, like and subscribe my channel and see you in the next tutorial take care of yourself love face